All right, guys, I wanted to show you guys in this video um, some connectors you can get off of eBay. And I've already opened one up. Comes in a package. It's, it's from China, but they're really nice. Check that out. Comes in a nice sealed package. And I already got one opened up here. So it's got a cap. And it's uh, you have to order female and male connector and what this is good for is using on your dash if you don't like to solder uh, and I recommend putting one of these because it's really simple to use and it's a quick disconnect so if you need to service your dash you need to remove the dash and you're gonna have to probably do it a lot because sometimes things fail your voice box goes out or a plastic bezel uh, melts from the Sun or whatever uh, and you need to take the dash out well all you have to do is disconnect it and actually in the show they kind of had a connector kind of like this too uh, you can get the smaller ones the solder ones they're they're a lot smaller but again you have to solder so when you open this up you're gonna see inside it has uh, connection ports I'm gonna take it all the way out so you can see it better and you can see it's got uh, your screws um, connectors and I already screwed these in. This is, you can take this off so you can see better. So, all you do is you take your wire, I've got a couple wires here, and insert it into the hole. It's, it's similar to the Knight Rider stuff, uh, the electronics. You just put it in and then you tighten up the, the nut on top. And um, this comes up to, I think there's 25 and a ground on here. So, there's 25 connectors on this thing. It's on a nice little proto board as you can see here and I think I paid five six bucks for this which is really cheap considering I think the other smaller ones are, are just as costly so um, yeah this came straight from China from uh, North Road Jing long building wherever that is um, but yeah I would definitely recommend this um, that way when you hook up your electronics, your dash electronics from whoever they're from, Jupiter or ZA Electronics or ID Geniali, whoever you get it from, it's real simple because you're not going to have more than uh, 20 inputs most likely if you're doing a basic hookup, which is just your oil, your temp, your fuel, and um, uh, what else is there, RPM and all that. It's, that's only going to take five or six of these. Uh, your pod uh, buttons you can connect this to because like I said you got 25 of these so five for your dash inputs and then you you're gonna have like 20 20 extra some people put their pods and they actually mold them to the dash so you want to be able to connect it all at one in one uh, connector so if you're using a pod though with like mp3 sounds you probably will want to run that separate to another connector uh, but but you don't have to like I said I'm probably going to use one for my whole dash for the pod units because I'm gonna have 20 inputs so 20 of the inputs are going to be for my pod connectors and then um, the rest for the dash but yeah it's pretty nice definitely recommend it I'll leave a link in the description and um, comes with some screws for your cable tie down and really nice a really nice uh, connector this quick quick disconnect is what I like to call them and the bag says they're called they're called uh, industrial plug connector so H by HD link so two of these together yeah, you're gonna you're gonna be this big so if you're concerned about it being too big uh, you can go with the, the uh, solder ones that are only like that they're about two inches shorter but yeah this is this is real good for if you don't like to solder guys so that's my review on these things and I recommend these for your dash um, also I ordered some of these so when I'm installing my dash electronics I can run zip ties 
from the dash or the pod, whatever I want to stick these to. I recommend these too. And that's it for this video. I'm all dirty. I gotta go clean up. I was working on a bumper, so catch you guys in the next one.